How many women do you know that are so giving and generous and supportive and loving to everyone in their lives, to those around them, except for themselves? I see this all the time, and I would have to say I think I fall into this category, and maybe you do too, of wanting to serve and taking care of everyone, taking care of your family, taking care of your clients, being there and being a positive and supportive role for those in your life, but then having a constant stream of self-critical thoughts. Ugh, you're not good enough. You're not, gosh, I look ugly today. I can't believe that, um, you know, I can't believe this is how I'm showing up. I'm going to a meeting looking like this. Um, all of the things that that voice, that constant chatter in our heads is telling us of why we're not good enough, we didn't get enough done, oh look, you did this again. Um, I'm sure you can relate that there's, there's a voice and a constant dialogue where a lot of times women are beating themselves up. I'm Cassie Nevitt. I'm the creator of Present with Confidence and a level two certified teacher in the art of feminine presence. And if you can relate to this or if there's a woman in your life that's coming to mind where you know she's holding it all together and giving so much to others and beating herself up at the same time and you know she deserves more, I have a special invitation for you. It's a class coming up called the Art of Feminine Presence. And this to me is the most meaningful body of work that I've ever come across and it's very supportive to women. So I wanna share a little bit about what it is that we do in the class, what you're gonna get out of the class, and then I would love for you to join us if it feels like it's something that resonates with you. So the class is all about being able to show up, being able to be seen and heard and respected when you do speak up, when you do show up in your life. And that applies to all situations. For some people, the big challenge, I hear this over and over is, Walking back into a family dynamic, you know, going to a family gathering or a family reunion, and it's those old habits of, you know, I've changed and I'm this kind of different person than the rest of my family. They don't get it. They don't really understand it. So I try to squeeze in and shrink into this box or just stay quiet when I'm there. And what I've found is that women taking the art of feminine presence, even if they're not consciously thinking of it and doing a whole thing to prep themselves to walk into that space, they find that they're able to be comfortable in their own skin. They show up as themselves, they speak up as themselves, and they actually have a better time and an easier time relating to everyone in their family than when they're trying to stick themselves into that box of who they really don't feel like they are anymore, but they're expected to be. For you, maybe it's a family thing. For a lot of you, it could be speaking up about an issue that you feel really passionate about or you feel that you've got a strong pull behind a particular cause, but you don't always have the confidence to say it. This will be in a business setting for some of you, maybe in a political setting for some of you, whatever that is. Imagine being able to walk into that space and hold your own and confidently and respectfully share your view and have that really be received by people. Okay, the other big thing that I see is, is communicating clear boundaries. And so often when we have identified that we want to create a boundary, we want somebody to see that this is really all I'm willing to do and I'm not gonna go beyond it. We do it with anger, we do it with aggression or hostility because we've decided enough is enough, this is kind of the end of it. And a lot of times it's not well received and it's not even effective when we do that. So Art of Feminine Presence is about helping you be able to set those clear boundaries, but to do it with an open heart and to do it in a loving way that's very effective, more effective than the other way, and that feels good to both parties. Those are some of the big things, and really for me personally and for a lot of the women in the group, the biggest takeaway from this experience is reconnecting to and remembering the value that you are. It's so easy to forget with that constant voice of, I'm not good enough, I'm not smart enough, I'm not pretty enough, I'm not whatever it is, to be reminded, and not in a superficial way, to be reminded at your core of how beautiful and powerful and capable you really are in your life. 
And for me, this is a weekly reminder and I need it that often, which is why this class is so, so powerful and I keep teaching it and I keep coming back and why we have women that are re-enrolling in this class all the time. So if any of those challenges are resonating with you or if this is the type of group that you wanna be a part of, a nurturing and supportive, positive group of women that come together, not just to be able to settle your mind and get grounded, which is a huge part of it, but to be able to have that actually apply to the practical situations that matter in your life, to have you show up differently and show up at your best, no matter what's going on around you, and to have you be able to feel comfortable in your skin, no matter where you are, no matter what's going on. If you're ready to join us, we have a, an introduction to the art of feminine presence coming up this week. It's on Thursday, March 31st in the morning. So please sign up for that, see the link, and for that, it's only $25 for you to come and try it out. Plus, if you bring a friend, then both of you get to come for free. So it's sort of a no-brainer if you're curious and you want to give this a, a test and, and try it out. It's our sampler platter, so to speak. And if you really want that deep change, you want the ongoing transformation and that ongoing support, join us for our five-week series of Art of Feminine Presence that's coming up starting on April 21st. And that's on early bird special through April 7th. I've extended it an extra week from what I'd originally said. So through April 7th, you can save $50 and get in for $247 versus the regular price of $297. And I'd love for you to join us for that. Again, let me know if you have any questions and be sure to click on the links below to register for one or both or however it feels good for you for the intro this coming Thursday and for the five-week series starting April 21st. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you soon.